guys i got another video for you here and um this one's about who created god but before i get into that i want to thank those of you that have been requesting videos and i want to thank those of you that uh have been um questioning the things that i'm teaching about so that way i can give you more detail and explain things to you um and i would, if you guys have any uh requests for videos just comment down below um and I will try to get to, uh, I will try to talk about those things. I will pray about them and ask for wisdom and stuff like that. Um, so anyway, let's, with that, let's get started. So something that I wrote down that I felt the Holy Spirit had given me uh, was that, you know, as creation, we feel everything must have been created, including God. This is also a big reason why people walk away, um, because we can't make sense of God. Uh, the Bible says not to lean on our own understanding. It also says that God's mind is far beyond our own. Um, so to pretty much sum up what I'm saying is that, you know, just because you don't have the answers does not mean that God is not real. Um, you know, if I hear about somebody way across the world, doesn't that doesn't make them not real just because I don't know who they are. Um just because I, I hear all the all these things about them or about them does not make them less real. It just means that I don't know. Um, so to create, you cannot be the creation. In other words, you have to be outside what you're creating. Um, so creating a kid, you can't be that kid that you're creating. You have to be outside of that. If I'm... <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Um, if you create a child, you like I just said, you cannot be that child that you are creating. So there was a video. To wrap this up, um, there's a video that I, I've seen a couple times on Facebook. And this guy, he... Um, there's an unbeliever and a believer. And the unbeliever asks the Christian, he says, um, you know... If God's real, who created God? And he's the. I think one of the first things that he said was, first off, you're assuming a limited God, which is not who my God is. My God is said to be unlimited. So he's not restricted by certain things, guys. Uh, so God is outside of time, space, and matter, which allowed him to create all of those things. Okay, Just like the child thing. Can't create a child if you are the child. Um, God cannot create a person like all of humanity, all of people, if he is people. Okay. Um, he's not a limited God, which means that he can come in the form of a man, Jesus. Um, Jesus was God and he came down into the, into a form of a man. Um, so you have to have an uncaused cause, okay? Uh, God was not uh, affected by the things that we know about. He wasn't affected by science. He wasn't affected by reproduction, nothing like that. He was outside of all that. He was uncaused, but he caused everything. So an uncaused cause. So with that, guys, um, thank you for watching, and I hope that you learned something. Um, if you have any questions about this, Comment down below. Uh, let me know what you think. And if you have any ideas, comment, comment down below. And I will see if I can do those videos. Um, with that, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.